Good morning, Royals. Welcome back to my channel. For those of you who are new here, I'm Princess Nitra. Welcome. Today's video is gonna be a quick one. I have some pole beans that I really need to pot up because they're just getting super big and they're still in their seedling tray. So I'm gonna show you how to pot your pole beans that you grew from little seedlings or I don't know, maybe you got them from a nursery or something. So I'm gonna show you how to pot up pole beans in a container and yeah, get them started on their trellis and all that jazz. So let's go ahead and get right into it. pole beans I will be using a five gallon bucket that I bought from Lowe's so that's what I'm going to use to plant them and I just filled up the container about two inches from the top so give it a little space to you know absorb the water and things like that so we'll go ahead and plant our beans into this bucket and I'll show you how all right so we got our pole beans we got our soil I'm gonna put however many are in here into the bucket okay so here I have my seedlings these are um I think this is seven seedlings so we're gonna pop those into the bucket so in order to get the seedlings out all you want to do is kind of scrunch the bottom and look at this these are so look at this look at this root system these are so overgrown so these are in dire need for repotting right now <laughs> so we're gonna go ahead and just when you're potting your pole beans you want to just stick your finger into the soil and kind of create just like a little cylinder shape so that the bean just goes right in and then you just cover it okay easy as that my son is out here with me um, in the garden most days so if you see his little feet running around here and you hear background noise that is him okay so we're gonna do one more Hey, Hancham. Okay. And just um, separate them. I'm doing about three inches. And just stick it right down in there. All right. So we'll go ahead and do the rest. <laughs> Drunk, I've never seen you clearer than now. We're flying high, floating somewhere up in the clouds. We're going out of ourselves, can you feel it? Almost like I don't know if it's real. Cause when we're doing our thing, we're the wheels that won't stop turning. So take me on a trip, trip, trip. Nah, trip, trip, trip. Oh, I flick the switch, kill the lights. Oh, I wasted. City lights are shining so bright. All these empty faces. We don't care about them tonight. We're going out of ourselves. Can you feel it? Almost like I don't know if it's real. Cause when we're doing our thing, we're the wheels that won't stop turning. I know we're acting stupid.
Pupu put my little marker in for me. Thank you, Pupu. Mama needed that. All right, so we got our pole beans nicely planted. They are looking amazing. And we're gonna go ahead and show you um, just how to set them up by their trellis. So sorry if the lighting is bad, but I just I just sat my little seedlings right up against this trellis that I made. Um, this is a DIY trellis. It is like a triangle shape. So the beans will just go ahead and start climbing up. And if you are interested in this trellis, I am going to be doing a video over it um, here soon. So give me about a week and I'll have the video up on that. But yeah. It is as easy as that. Just put your um, beans up against your trellis and they will start to climb and grab onto whatever you're gonna be supporting them with. I'm super excited to see how these do. They definitely needed um, to be transplanted. I'm gonna go ahead and water these in really nicely. and they should start to grow beautifully. And I will definitely keep you guys updated on how these are doing and once we harvest and all of that good stuff, but I'll definitely do an update video on when they start to climb the trellis and everything like that. Okay, so after I planted the beans, I did go ahead and water them in deeply just to make sure all the soil was saturated. Um, and I did fertilize using a soluble fertilizer. I usually use I usually use fish fertilizer. This is Alaska fish fertilizer. So go ahead and fertilize once you've planted those seedlings because they are going to need the nutrients right away. And yeah, you are off to a great start with your pole beans. So I hope this video helped you out. If it did, make sure you give me a big thumbs up, comment down below, and let me know what type of beans you'll be planting this season. And yeah, I will see you in my next video. Bye, Royals.